Hello my YouTube friends, so today what I got for you, uh, I just have my new toy right here. It is a uh, Logitech keyboard right here, the model um, K480 Logitech multiple device. So very much this, this uh, keyboard right here will give you connection to your phone, your tablet, your computer, uh, pretty much any device. And uh, I'm gonna open it and uh, connect to my phone to see how it works and uh, we're gonna test it out to see if it's really working and how cool it is so let's get to it so this is the model um you know Log logitech so logitech k4a0 and this one I got it from uh, stable for thirty four ninety nine dollar plus tax. So it's come out like a little bit over thirty seven dollars. So let's see how amazing this one is. It's got a lot of good review on it, and it's working for Windows, Mac, Chrome OS, Android, iOS system. So pretty much is cover. Uh, pretty much all the device on the market today with the Bluetooth connection. All right, so let's open it. And inside, you see this cool looking, um, you know, keyboard right here. Logitech. Let's unwrap it. Let's come with the um, instruction right here. Yeah, don't really need that for now. So, gotta cut on the top here so that you can put your device in you know slide your your iphone tablet ipad or anything you know pretty much anything that the slot for it cool looking one the key is uh you know the feeling on this key is pretty good as well it's it's actually decent decent quality because you know that um Logitech has been around for a while now, so they had good quality in their products. And uh, you see this knob right here, that's for um, your, you know, selection of uh, different device. And you can connect up to like three different devices. So that's pretty cool of it. And it's already come with the, the battery, it's in, a, in the back here. There's a slot right here. It's a slide it open. You see the two double, I mean triple A battery in here. And you just close it back on. There's a switch on the right here. So there's a switch on. You see the, the ring light's on, that's mean it's on. And then, so this knob right here is for choosing different devices. So let's try number two. <laughs> so for connection over here, you see um, either PC or iOS or Mac OS. So to connect it, you hold the button. So what is it? So one, two, three, you select uh, what number you want to connect to. Then you either hit PC or Mac OS or iOS. So I have the iPhone right here for demonstration. So I'm gonna go to um, so pretty much I'm gonna go to setting for Bluetooth on. And at the same time, when I got a Bluetooth on, I'm gonna hit the connection on here, the Bluetooth connect. The Bluetooth connect here. So we're gonna hold it for three seconds. So you get a Bluetooth on here, and you're gonna hold this button down for three seconds. And then flashing, so it's ready. And then your phone is searching. It's already found the keyboard for A0 right here. You hit it, connect. Select it to connect. You say connect it. So pretty much that is ready. So the keyboard already connected. 
so you can use it to type to control um, your phone so remember to go back to home and if you decide to use um, you know like texting or typing so you go to type in note you just open it up and pretty much you can type anything So we good there. We turn on the phone. Then we can type right now. Start typing. So let's see. Logitech. K four A zero. Enter space. Hello. It is Logitech. K. For AD multiple device Bluetooth connection keyboard. So the key on it is feeling feeling very good, you know the. The keystroke is very very decent. It doesn't feel um, sharp or anything. It's kind of like at that mechanical feel type of. So pretty much it has a lot of good function on it. And also we can use it to go to. Uh, you now if we go to. At the case on just kind of um, harder to control. So all right, let's go to. Um, web searching and then we just type in logitech k for a zero see and then we can use a you know we touch it so we use the arrow to control the up and down motion Is and we can use the, the tap key function also. Then we can open and close, you know, which will T to put new tab, draw w, w to uh, you know, delete it. So T, and then the, the home key right here, you can use it to go back to home. Then you can control the volume also. Just pretty cool, and you can turn it off, put it sleep, turn it on. Then you can search row here, like F five to search. Type in uh, Honda. Then I'll look it up the search right here. That's map right there. What else we got here? Then home. And another way that you can use pretty much full function of this keyboard is you go to setting. So go setting. And you look, roll down to look for access, uh, access, a Ability, and then you look for keyboard and then full keyboard access then you can turn it on then you have full um, control of the keyboard and uh, you can see the list of uh, you know what you do um, like tap edge to go home um, tap to move forward move backward and like shift tap space to activate so pretty much you can do that also so I'm going to use tab and edge to so help. See, I'll, I'll roll up the, it's so up the list, uh, you know, example of uh, what the, the function on it. 
And then you can roll up and down to, to see what function it has. Then to turn it off, you do the same thing, tap edge, I'll turn it off. All right, so let's continue. So we already have the connection for our phone and uh, the keyboard. So pretty much I can use the full function of, uh, of the keyboard right now. Then I can hit like control. Um, I tap app, then you can switch between like different app also. Then I use uh, this tap to to activate it. Then up here you can see also uh, searching web. Then I can type in you know uh, Logitech. A for A zero search, and also you um, it all pop up the website, and then we can use the. Then we can turn on the the gesture also with tap G, and that turn on. And then you can like use the arrow as a gesture right there, like to to slide up and down. Or you can like zoom it in also. And you can hold it and just drag the the screen like up slowly. Now you can hold the control button with the arrow so bring it up and down uh, nice star FN then you can like hit command right here to zoom it in or zoom it out like zoom it out like command and the arrow or command and the arrow the down arrow to zoom out or zoom in I mean zoom out right here, and then zoom in. What else can we use for? And then we help right here. Tap edge for help. Moving forward, tap. Move up and down. The gesture is still on, so... You can turn it up with tap G again. Now you hold the tap and then hold the G. It, then keyboard gesture disable. And then you can see the the help menu right there. Move up and down. Space. And then if you want to go home, then you hit command edge. I'll turn back to home. And you want to cancel the helping menu, you hit tap and edge again. And then you can use this arrow to select in the you know, um, you notice this ring um, color right here. Let's go down here now to news, to health. Now we can use the arrow to maneuver, uh, maneuver to different app. Just using the keyboard. So now send text message, call. Then it's in the last Safira right now, and you want to activate it. Hit space, then activate that. And you can use a tap to control it also. Then I'll go to a different. Uh, see, and then you want to roll up and down, just hit control and the arrow. You want to open a new tab and T 
like command T to open new tab and you delete it to like command W then you want to search it then on Logitech K4 A0 then hit enter that search it up for you you want to look for Yep, so that's what I got for you. That's my toy that I use. I just got it, so I'm gonna use it for a little bit to see how it works, how I like it. So far, I like it. It give me uh, ease, you know, the um, the typing. You know, it's help helping with the uh, typing a lot. And then I can go, um, you know, tap home. I mean, command H for go back and home. I like it for typing, like for example, we choose a, uh, you know, it's kind of hard for you to see. Let's go to note right now, activate it, and then we can like, start typing. Then you can like delete it to function there, delete it. Then we can type like uh, load is Logitech K four D switch type in between your computer phone and tablet so a pretty good uh, feeling for typing so I like it so far it just uh, make it easier make much much easier than use your thumb yes your thumb is like quick but for typing a lot of um, you can type a whole document with this on uh, on this uh, keyboard right here and on uh, the iPhone so let's go back home control control edge so yeah this pretty much like this Logitech keyboard actually work and it works with multiple device I try it so yeah that's pretty much it I got for you uh, as you look into one you know simple keyboard for multiple device use it then this is one of them then you can look into it and uh, check it out all right thank you for checking this out have a wonderful day and uh, i'll see you guys on the next one